good morning. Welcome to this week's video. Um, this week we've come down to a, a new location um, down on Dartmoor. This is a Wisman's wood. It's getting very, very busy. So this wood is a little bit more out the way. So, uh, so yeah, so we've come to this wood, um, another ancient woodland on Dartmoor. Um, I'm not going to tell you where it is, but it's 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 no secret really. With a with a bit of with a bit of search for ancient woodlands on on Dartmoor, you, you would find it. Um, but it is looking very nice at the moment. Uh, this morning is just more of a scouting mission. Uh, not really. It's it's going to give us some shots, I know, but um, you know it'll be, it'll be an amazing woodland with a bit of mist and a bit of fog. So, um, but. For today, just a bit of a scouting mission. Get a few record shots, so we uh, got something to got something to use in the future. So, stick with me. Let's have a look around and see what we can find. So, just uh, getting the first shot of the day here. Um, I think sunlight. Uh, there is some cloud coming over. Um, the sun is quite breaking through, quite bright at the moment. Uh, which has given us some real harsh contrasts. Um, so yeah, it's not ideal this area for woodlands. Um, it is a little bit thicker up in the in the back of the copse there. So I think I'm going to head up into there, which will be a bit more shaded. Try and search out some some subjects. Um, but to start with, I just wanted to take uh, take advantage. I've got this nice colour in this foxglove here and then we've got a wall leading off here base of a wall leading off to this uh, tree or a couple of trees in the background so I'm just using this foxglove here in the foreground and then um, shooting through to that with the wall leading through to the tree in the background so okay so that's my composition in the back of the camera and that sun's just gone in, so I think I'm going to take advantage. Um, although it was just now actually just really lighting up on this foxglove, which gave me some, gave a nice shot. So um, shooting at f11. Uh, now that sun's gone down, I'm actually shooting at one eighth of a second. Uh, I was slightly faster just now when the sun was out. Um, but yeah. Let's get the shot and then have a have another bit of a skate round. Yes, so I'm uh, quite liking this. It's got so much potential in the in the in the right conditions. It, it's nice today. There's um, there's some nice shots to be had. Um, but given some, if if we had some misty, foggy conditions, it would be fantastic here. Um, so a bit like Wisman's. Uh, let me turn you around a sec. Bit like Wisman's, we've got the uh, mossy, mossy rocks, some old twisted trees. Um, yeah, very similar woodland. Very similar woodland, um, with the added bonus of some open areas as well, and uh, a bit of flowing water. Okay, like I say, just getting some record shots today, but this is. Uh, some nice areas up around here with some nice old twisted trees as you know I like a good old gnarly twisted tree um, bit of light breaking through every now and again um, on the top of this these mossy rocks which is nice um, so yeah getting some shots I 
a car. I'm absolutely loving this Z7 II. It is, it is just an incredible bit of kit. But there is a couple of niggly things that are annoying me, which I will cover in a separate video. But one I'm just going to mention now. The two-second timer. It's there, set on two-second timer. Perfect, great, fantastic, crack shot. Turn it off, or if it times out, turn it back on, and it's reset back to single. You have to reset it back to two-second timer every time. I need to look into the menu. I'm sure there's a way of fixing it. I know somebody has said that one way of doing it is to uh, delay the shutter. In, you can delay the shutter by two two seconds, but then that does it on every shot. So, um, and then I could end up missing stuff. So I don't really want to set that in as a permanent setting. But yeah, just one annoying thing with this. Otherwise, fantastic bit of kit. Okay, I'm not getting to uh, talk you through too much because um, I'm just sort of taking shots as I see them um, as I've said before with woodland photography pick out things that uh, catch your eye obviously this tree here leaning into the scene causing that bit of a tunnel down almost like a tunnel down through that, that area down through there with a the mossy so um, I've just taken that um, I'll put that one up, let you have a look, and uh, I'm going to make my way up through. There's a, possibly another shot here, down between these two here, um, and then I'm going to walk on up through, up through into that woodland there, see what else we can see. Let me just say uh, thank you to those that uh, have entered the uh, the giveaway. Um, I'm I will have already drawn it. I haven't drawn it yet whilst I'm filming this, but I will have drawn it by the time this video goes out. So congratulations to whoever won. Um, and also just to let you know that I, um, as this video goes out, I will be on a plane on my way to Greece, um, and I'm having a two week break. In Greece so uh, there won't be any videos or more than likely there won't be any videos uh, whilst I'm away unless I get a chance to uh, pre-film a couple so um, maybe uh, maybe a couple of week break but uh, don't worry stick with me I will be back okay I'm uh, quite liking the look of this down through using a there is a tree just to this left right hand side Looking down through there with that other tree leaning off. But yeah, that's uh, look, we're just having a time shot between the light glaring through. Put the shot up, let you have a look. Okay, just making my way back now. Um, only got a few shots today, so um, not too much to talk through. But uh, let's say it was a bit more of a scouting mission. So um, yeah, gonna make our way back to vehicles now. Um, definitely come back here again when the conditions are right. So please, thanks again for watching. Please check out some of my other videos. And if you like what you're seeing, please hit that subscription button and the notification bell. Uh, give the video a thumbs up, that'd be much appreciated because it does help the old video searching. And also drop me a comment down below. So from a bit of a windy, blustery Dartmoor now, uh, heading back to the vehicles. Till next time, take it easy. Oh, 
come to come to Dartmoor, it'll be fun, they said. That storm just came through. Hailstones in July or June, whatever we're in. Absolutely soaked now. I think I might be driving home in my underpants. 